Hi everyone! In this video, you will learn how to utilize map geometry for advantage in Overwatch. High ground advantage. Control high ground positions to have better sight lines and angles for attacks. Cover usage. Use walls, pillars, and structures to break line of sight and protect yourself from enemy fire. Flanking routes. Learn and use flanking routes to surprise enemies and attack from unexpected angles. Choke points. Position defensively. Position defensively at choke points to control enemy movement and force engagement on your terms. Environmental hazards. Use map hazards like pits or clips to boop enemies off or deny them safe passage. Sniper purchase. Utilize spots that provide clear sight lines for snipers to maximize their effectiveness. Baiting enemies. Lure enemies into narrow corridors where they are vulnerable to area of effect attacks. Jock points. Use corners and sharp turns juke points. Use corners and sharp turns to juke enemies chasing you. Especially effective for agile heroes like Tracers or Genji. Map Reset Retreat to areas where health packs are abundant to, to quickly heal and re-engage. Objective Control Position near objective points to contest or defend them effectively. Line of Sight Denial Block enemy sightlines with structures or objectives to limit their ability to attack or heal from a distance. Ambush spots. Hide in strategic spots to surprise enemy passing by or setting up for an attack. Map control points. Secure map control points to deny enemies access to advantageous positions. Anchor points. Hold anchor points that provide strategic advantages for your team's positioning and defense. Map Knowledge Study each map's layout to anticipate enemy movements and find advantageous positions. Flank Defense Position yourself or your team to defend against potential flanks from the enemy. And that's how to utilize map geometry for advantage in Overwatch. If you like this video, please click the like and subscribe and ring the bell icon to notify you to our next video. Thank you for watching.